I watched a video a few minutes ago, Mudahar talking about the AI art protests and weird uh, generation tools that have been used to kind of effectively take commission work away from other artists. And it's a hard subject to think about ultimately because there's a lot that goes into it that I don't think is getting looked at from the one-sided conversation that's being had. Ultimately, what these AI art generators are is a glorified procedural generator fed some stuff that it uses to procedurally generate. AI is such a generous term for a machine system that has existed for how many fucking years? This isn't even something new. It's just how we're using it that's making the difference here, right? And I agree with one fundamental thing. AI art is definitely leaving a gaping hole in the art industry, but that's not the ultimate issue for me here. The ultimate issue for me here is inside of that, as much as I want artists to be protected, I also want those procedural generators to fall under the same fair use laws that every other kind of content creation falls under. So say, taking a single artist's work and feeding all of that work into an AI generator to then train your AI to only make that style of art, and then recreating a piece of that artist's artwork would then be copyright infringement directly. Plagiarism, the use of another artist's work totally without permission, there is no fair use in that. On the other hand, much like content creators on YouTube like to use pieces of everybody else's work in their own stuff to make their videos happen, AI art needs to be protected. We have to stop and take a look at fundamentally what was fed into an AI art generator and whether or not what came out of it was transformative enough to be diversified from the original image. If it stands out and is distinguishable, it's fair use. Much like the content we have on YouTube, if it is transformative, it's fair use. Now there's a real spotty gray area with fair use and copyright. Nobody really seems to know how it works. I've been listening to it since I was 14, 15, and couldn't for the life of me now tell you the entirety of how it works because it really is a circumstance by circumstance kind of law. But I do believe that regardless of what anybody thinks, it has to be treated equally as any as equally as any other creative medium. We can't just treat AI art like some kind of pariah thing because we've slapped the fancy AI letters in front of a glorified procedural generator and made it sound way more living than it is. It's not a sentient being that like calls out to you and creates something from its own thoughts that it picked up from its own intuition. There is no intuition. It's not really intelligent by any means, it's just a glorified procedural generator that you feed data into. And whatever pops out of it, if it's transformative, kind of has to be considered for fair use. Thank you, and have a nice day.